are so good. I I love this hair, man. welcome back to my channel so in this video i'll be giving you guys the promised limoda hair review on this curly hair unit if you haven't already make sure you have watched the other previous hair construction video which will be on the screen right now the link will also be in the description down below i would have put it into one video but the clips from this part of the video was too long which is why i made two separate videos i don't want to keep you guys for too long this video will be a comprehensive hair review so i hope you guys enjoy it before I get into the video, make sure you've given this video a thumbs up and subscribe with your post notifications turned on. I'm really trying to get 500 subscribers, so I'd really appreciate your support if you could subscribe. Anyways, let's get right into the video. So as you can see, I am cutting the lace off the hair. Um, you don't want to cut too close to the hair because if you want to customise it, you'd have enough room. But yeah, I'm just cutting off all the lace um, and adjusting it to my hair. Kind of the front to make sure not too much lace is that left over. Then at this point, I'm just pulling the hair forward, um, ready to cut behind the ears. adjusting it to make sure that it fits my head and that's that so at this point I glue down the hair onto my head and secured it with an elastic band to set the hair and yeah now I'm just playing around just feeding up the hair like <laughs> yeah she can't take me seriously um yeah so I was just getting ready for the other video I was gonna film that day um it's the updated makeup routine make sure you go ahead and watch that video so at this point yeah I'm just brushing up I'm combing out the hair and packing it back for the video I'm not really gonna talk too much but yeah this will all be in the other video so make sure you go ahead and watch that so at this point I've done my makeup and I was gonna spray my hair with water but the spray bottle was not working as you can see so I then began to moisturize my hair with hair serum to prep it um yeah so that's what i'm doing at this point i thought the spray bottle started working again so i got excited but then it didn't so yeah <laughs> that's why i look disappointed um yeah so then i decided to transfer the water from the, the spray bottle into my other conditioner bottle and started doing that instead it worked pretty well but it sprayed like a mist so not a lot of water came like comes out at a time but yeah as i was saying the hair serum and everything i was using um i put them on the screen and i also put them in the description box down below also with a link that you guys can click to get it they are affiliate links which means that when you click it i get a small commission yeah so at this point i'm done moisturizing the hair I'm just gonna do the hair reveal. As you can see, my gluing skills are not the best, but you know, you actually live and you learn. But yeah, hopefully I can like mentally decide what clip goes with what video. Just got done filming a makeup video. So yeah, now I'm gonna look for a brush so I can blend my scarf. Guys, what do you think about this hair? Like I've had this hair for like a few months, but I just haven't had time to put it together. Um, it wasn't it's not a pre-made wig i made the wig myself yesterday getting better um yeah i'm not a professional wig maker but 
I like to do it myself because I don't want to like spend money when I can learn to do stuff myself, you know. So, look, I didn't even glue it on properly, but all in all, like it's a pretty nice wig. Um, um, when I was doing the wig though, like it shed quite a lot. Like I was, it was getting bare tangled, and I was so confused. Like I'm thinking, like is this really Lamoda? Like, what did I did I get? Um, did someone send me some next hair because it was shed like it was tangling so much and i was so confused because like obviously as i was making the wig like i'd comb through it um from time to time yeah so that's that's one thing another thing is thinking of cons here so yeah it just sheds a bit um can't think of any more cons actually like it takes to like the water really well and like the curls are so pretty like it's so like has such pretty curls i haven't finished um fully um styling it I've literally just put water in it. I styled it a bit yesterday when I finished the wig. Um, I think it's a 13 by 4 frontal wig. Yeah, I think it's a 13 by 4 frontal wig. Um, it's really nice. Like, I really like it. The last time I had curly hair was like a few years ago. Um, but even so, I bought a really cheap one. So like the closure was like really thick. And at the time, I didn't really do hair like that as well. So it was really hard to manage. But I really like this one. Oh my god. <laughs> Anyways, if you see me rocking curly hair from now on, it's your fine, period. But um, what else? Yeah, the hair, I really like the hair. Like, it's really nice. The frontal is really, frontal is really good. It comes pre-plucked, but you can pluck it, like, yourself. I bleached, I bleached and, um, what's the word? Bleached and plucked it myself. Um, what else do people talk about in reviews? Because I don't know what to say. Let me go watch a review, I'll be right back. So, um, yeah, this is a 13 by 4 frontal wig um, by Lamoda. I got sent this hair because I won some giveaway. I'm just like, you know what, let me just do a review on it because I have another Lamoda hair um, frontal wig, straight frontal wig, and I always get questions on it. Like, the hair is eight months old, and like people always ask me like if it's new. So, Lamoda's, Lamoda's got really good quality hair. Lamoda sponsored me. Um, but, yeah, so this is a 14-inch frontal uh, six and 16 18 and 20 inch bundles i didn't even finish using the bundles this is the box this is the box that came in and this is the rest of the hair like this is the rest of the 16 inch um that's the rest of the 16 inch bundle because i i put in like videos of when i was doing that hair but um i put the um bundles in like quite like fairly close together and still i had bundles left over so it's really come your bundles come really thick what's it called yeah it's true to length it's fairly true to length because i'm i'm quite short i'm like five foot two and it comes like here so if it was straightened it's even it's quite long as well so so there's that and the hair is so soft guys like when i like it tangled a lot when i was actually doing it and it was dry but like i didn't expect that because none of my other wigs have done that like i've had one curly wig before and the wig like i don't it wasn't like it, doesn't, it didn't tangle like that even when it was dry so i was very confused like when this one um this one like was tangling up but as soon as like i wet it and started styling it like it's so easy to run my hands through it that, um, I think this is a medium brown, it has a medium brown lace um, as a frontal and it's not too bad, like the frontal is really good, the actual lace is really good, the only issue is me, like I need to work on my gluing skills. It takes to the water so well, like I don't even need to spray it that much and already like it's coming pretty like and um, it's a thing where like even when it's puffy and not wet it still looks nice and um like i've mentioned briefly before i styled it um when i finished making the wig which was last night and i woke up this morning and the curls that like like it still held and it still looked wet but it was dry obviously i was like so that's really good as well so like if you were to take it out you wouldn't have to like keep constantly wetting it and because it holds the curls really well once it's wet um, yeah, I'm, I'm just wetting it because I want like, I don't want to miss any spots in it. So yeah, I've just put my mousse in it. Oh yeah, I don't think I finished talking about it, but 
I'm sorry if this video is like all around the place, but it's one of my first review videos, so yeah. So like I was saying, I didn't um I didn't use all the bundles. I use like I just use like one, no two, two and a bit, like literally two and a bit. Like I I use barely any of the 16 inch one. Like I just used it like a few layers here, and then that was it. Uh, the wig is really full, it's true to length. Like it's so it's soft. Um, yeah. Um, another thing is um, the actual waves in the hair like it, it's the curls are so pretty and it actually runs all the way through the hair I don't know if I want to do a middle part in I think I'm going to do a side part in but yeah the curls run all the, like all throughout the hair um, and it's not like it doesn't lose its curl consistency or curl pattern as the hair like approaches the end which is really good like the ends are still really nice so did i mention what style it was i think it's a deep wave, is it deep wave, or wave? i can't remember but i'll put it in the like, i'll put any corrections in the video um when i actually find out what it is but yeah guys i i, I'm, I just love this hair ah uh, i love this hair Oh yeah, another thing, um, because the curls hold so well, one thing I'd like you actually don't have to do is use got to be like when I had the the curly wig before, um, I would have to use got to be to like hold the curls in and even then it would still get like really like puffy and just like just like be messy in it. But um this one like I said, as soon as when I finished doing the wig, I styled it and then this one I woke up and it was still in check, so I was like yeah so that's one thing like and there's a thing where like when i had my curly wig before i didn't want to wear it like out as much because i'd I'd have to constantly wet it but this one seems like i don't um, um if you guys are looking for regular updates on the hair make sure to follow me on my social media and um, i put on the screen right now um and i'll yeah put updates on there because to make a whole video is also another thing but um yeah like so far so good i i love this hair man I think next time I'll probably go for a longer length or maybe I'll add colours, I don't know. Um, any hairdressers, any colourists in hair I'm looking to collab, I'm down. So um, yeah, so yeah, in a nutshell, the pros are the frontal is amazing, like literally, it's really nice um, for the price. It's full, it's true to length. Also the curl pattern like it really it takes the water really well which is good so you don't have to be like spending a lot of time watering it down um even though you shouldn't anyway but um yeah not a lot of time needs to spend needs to be spent actually like watering the hair because it takes the water like so well and um after being styled it holds really well like i said this video is never sponsored so i'm just spitting facts it styles really well and it's real cute it's real cute and the cons is just like when it when it was dry like when i was styling it at first it was just shedding and i was thinking what's going on like i was so confused but um that's pretty much the only con i've come across now like even now it just sheds a bit as well and i found myself like having to keep like watering the ends i don't know if that's just because i don't water it enough but i did so yeah i just have to find myself like watering the ends a bit because i kind of i like the ends looking like this you know what i mean but i think aside from that if anything i'll um put it like as text on the video or i'll just update you guys on my social media so make sure you follow me over there as well um yeah i really like this hair so it's giving me like summery vibes and i'm all for it because now i know i don't have to spend time just watering down the hair every 10 10 or so minutes but yeah the stuff i use to start the hair is serum actually i go with my water first i had to change this bottle if you saw in the previous clips before i feel like the stuff i've forgotten but anyways if there's anything i put as text or just put on my um i put on my social media but yeah i had to put my water in here because it just kept like acting up like but anyway i need to go and buy mist spray 
but yeah so i use this to spray the water and even so like i feel like i low-key came up with something i don't know if it's already a thing but it's really good to actually take care of your weave the same way you take care of your natural hair so the same way you would put leave and conditioner in your natural hair you should always also do the same to your um wigs because it came from someone's head and it needs the same nutrients because your it's not coming from your head as well isn't it um so yeah spray of water with this and this has got a bit of leave-in conditioner in it so that's really good for the hair as well and then i go in with this mousse um it's really good but i don't know like it's it gets quite sticky after a while so that's a no then i go in with my serum just to give it a bit of shine um i went in with this yesterday to be honest i don't i don't i want to use these two um i don't want to use them at the same time because i want to know which mousse gives me the better like look yeah but i didn't um go in too much with this one because this is almost finished then i will go in with this but i haven't sprayed it yet but i'd go in with this just like give it a bit of gloss if you guys are looking for where to buy these um they are available in hair shops but um you can click my affiliate link in the description box down below to buy it off amazon yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did leave a big thumbs up down below also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notifications if you enjoyed the video if you're new here welcome to the family and if you are a returning subscriber thanks for your support so without further ado i'll see you guys in my next video Thank you.